Hello guys, Mr. E143. So for today's video, we are going to discuss the concept of the uh, set operation. Okay, so set operation. So there are um, four set of operation. Uh, the first one is the union of sets. The second one is the intersection of sets. Third one is the complement of a set. And the last one, the fourth one is the difference of set or the relative complement. Okay, so the first one, the first set of operation, the union of sets. So in this concept, uh, in, uh, in the concept of the union of sets, um, the union of two sets A and B assuming so assume that uh, we have the set A and set B. So two sets A and B is a set of all the elements present in A or present in B both. We will take the common elements at once on D. So denoted it is denoted that the symbol of the union is this one okay so union okay then this is read as union okay so union read as union okay then um for instance meron tayong a then union B. So, A union B. Okay? So, para mas madali maintindihan, in order to easily understand, let's have an example. So, meron tayong example na this one. So, given, given U, ang U dito is a universal set with an elements of, may mga elements siya na 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. Then, another given set, 1, 2, 3, 6, and the set B, is 2, 4, 6, 8. Okay. So, find A union B and A inter uh, intersection B. So, mamaya na yung intersection. So, dito muna tayo sa um, union. Okay. So, how do we answer this? So, very simple. Madali lang. Okay. So, kunin natin ng lahat ng elements ng A. Elements ng A is um, 1, 2, 3, 6, then union, operation, and then 2, 4, 6, and 8. Okay, so as as the concept of the union of sets, is the definition that two sets A and B, okay, uh, the set of elements which are present in A or present in B both. Ibig sabihin, lahat ng elements na meron sa A at meron din sa B. And then, we will take the common elements at once only. Ibig sabihin, isa lang kapag meron the repeated elements, isa lang ang dapat na kunin. For instance, meron tayo dito, meron 2, meron tayo 2, then 6, then 6. Okay, so isa lang, isa lang ang pagkuha natin dyan or pagsulat. So, we have 1, 2, 3, 6. Ah, okay, may 4 pa pala. 4, then 8. So, A union B is with an elements of 1, 2, 3, 6, 4, and 8. Okay, the cardinality is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 and cardinality. Okay, so, next. Next is the concept of the intersection of sets. Okay, so intersection of sets, according to the definition, the intersection of two sets A and B, okay, assume that A and B is the set, means that the set of all the elements which are common to both both A and B. Okay, so it is represented um, it is represented as symbol, this one. Okay, so Okay, so kabalik tara ng union. So, parang inverse niya. So, this one is read as intersection. intersection okay. so example okay. so yung example pa rin natin kanina taron tayo um, given na universal set and the set A and set B ok the second um, find the A union B na kuha natin ito then the second one is A intersection B ok so how do we answer that so katulad ng kanina so sagutin natin we have um, ang elements, yun pa rin, 1, 2, 3, 6, 
intersection um, 2, 4, 6, then 8. Okay, according to the concept of the intersection of sets, again, the set of all the elements which are common to both A and B. So, common ibig sabihin parehas. Okay, so, kung saan lang common, meron sa kanila, we have 2 and then 6. Okay, so 2 and 6, meaning the intersection of A and B is um, 2 then 6. Okay. That's it. Okay, so next is uh, find the A complement or A prime. So, ganyan yung symbol ng complement. So, A prime. So, the concept of the uh, complement of a set, according to the definition, the complement of a set A, okay, kung uh, example set A, the complement of set is the set of all the elements which are the set of the universal set but not the elements of A, okay, but not the elements of A. Um, it is represented the symbol this one, so A prime, okay, so A complement, A prime, A complement, okay. So, for example, again, the given is uh, above a uh, universal set, in parin, then set A, okay. So, again, the concept of the uh, complement of the set. Okay, let's uh, write first the elements 1, 2, um, 3, and 6. Okay, so uh, again, the set of all the elements which are in the set of the universal set, but not, uh, but not, element, but not elements of A. Okay, so for instance, this one, kung ito, lahat ng elements ng E, Titignan natin doon sa universal set. Yan, 1, 2, 3, then 6. Okay, so ibig sabihin, um, ang ano lang doon is, um, yung wala daw sa A. Ang A prime, sa madaling set is wala sa A na nasa universal set. So, ang meron is 4, um, 5, 7, and Eight. So this is the A complement. A complement is with an element of 4, 5, 7, and 8. Okay, so next, sagutin naman natin ang um, A relative complement B or difference of the A relative B. Okay, um, so relative complement, so A relative complement B, the concept of the relative complement is uh, the difference of, or the relative complement of two sets, A and B, represent as this one, A relative complement B, that is all the elements which are present in A but not in B. So again, present in A but not in B. That's the concept of the um, relative complement. Okay. So since uh, ang given natin, this one, ayan pa rin ang given natin, so, A relative complement B, again, the concept is the set of all the elements which are present in A but not. Okay, so, ang A natin is 1, 2, 3, 6. Then, relative complement B, 2, 4, 6, then 8. Okay, so, nakamadali is, again, the concept is the set of all the elements which are present in A but not in B. So always con we consider that we always um, um, take a look at the first uh, set. So always natin nakatingin tayo sa first set. Okay, so since uh, present in A but not in B, so cancel natin ang parehas. Yan, A. So it 6. Okay, so then, wala na din yan, ang 4 and 8. So, kasi present in A but not in B. The only elements of uh, A relative complement B is 1 and 3. Okay, so that's it. A relative complement B. Okay, so that's it.